Hey, do you know, uh, you know one of the worst things about being an American president? What's that? You don't get to, uh, you don't get to use the fine, the fine Mexican words like, uh, like sombrero and muchacho. I don't think those are Mexican words. That, that's, that's Spanish. Those are Spanish muchacho. words. Muchacho. Mucha quesadilla. Yeah, that's, that's Spanish, not, not Mexican. You never get to go... My fellow Americans, muchacho, my fellow muchachos, look at my new sombrero. I don't, I don't think that's a, I don't think that's a language thing. I think it's what you would and wouldn't say. You wouldn't say, my fellow, my fellow Americans, friends, friends, look at my new hat. It's not a language thing. It's, it's the message you're trying to get across. You know they've got. They've got like nine different words for friends. In English, you've got one word for friend, and that's friend. But in Mexican, you go no, you've got you've got muchacho, amigo. No, you've got several words. Hombre, hombre is like a friend. You, you've got several words for friends. No, 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 no. Hom hombre is like a friend who's hungry. You say, oh, hey, friend, are you hungry? That that qualifies you to be my hombre. What you're saying doesn't make any sense because you have several words in the English language for friend. You have buddy and chum. Muchacho! Amigo, would you like a quesadilla with your sombrero, muchacho? Uh, well, you know what sounds really good right now is a quesadilla. Quesadilla con carne, con pollo. Yeah, now you're talking. Con queso. Con queso. Muchacho yeah. con queso. Con queso. Con quesadilla con queso. So what you're saying then, as an American president, the worst thing about... Being an American president is that you can't just all of a sudden just start going quesadilla con queso. Quesadilla con queso. Now you're talking con queso. Taco. I don't mind beans on a quesadilla con queso. It's not that you can't just start going quesadilla muchacho. It's the fact that it's another language. The American people don't want that. They it but other languages too, like German. You can't all of a sudden start going. Uh, uh, quesadilla con queso dio. I don't know any German. Well, wouldn't you agree that you think, as an American president, you've got more important things to do than to go listing foods in other languages uh, to the American people? They, they already know that what foods are available in Mexico. I don't think they need to. Get, they don't need to hear it from a, a, the president. Oh, I think they do. I think that it would be a good thing. Four score and eight años ago, me and my muchachos had a tostada quesadilla. Oh, a tostada quesadilla. Con carne. Con, con car pollo. You are setting me. I'm getting hungry. You are saying then that it's just fun to say the words, not so much that you just. You want to say the food, you just you just like going blah 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 really loud and using the O vowel a lot. It's not about the vowel or there's no O in the Klingon alphabet. Did you know that? Oh right, well what does that have to do with anything? You can say the Klingon foods like heart of targ and Tognoth. And uh, no. Dirocha! No, Dirocha con queso con pollo. So it is a food thing then. You just like to just say food. You you gotta try you gotta try it. You don't know until you've tried it. Really give it up from the give it from the gut. Give it a muchacho. Muchacho. Don't be afraid to jump in on this one there, Jefferson. Just give it a give it a muchacho. Muchacho. Can we hit it on the count of three? You wanna give it a muchacho together? You wanna hit a uh, one, two, Three. 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 That's not bad. I say we do it one more. Time. Give it a one, two, three. Muchacho. 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 I say we're ready to take that on the road.